My name is Lasse Görlitz and I've been a hot dog aficionado since forever. And then five years ago in 2011, I started judging uh, the best tasting hot dogs uh, in a competition in Denmark. And since then I expanded, so I started rating hot dogs. I travel all over the world. Life as a hot dog judge is a lot of fun. Uh, I've been able to take a big passion of mine and actually make it into something that I get a lot of great uh, experiences and sometimes unique experiences out of. So a good hot dog will have a lot of different uh, tastes in them. You'll have some sweet, sour, salty and savory, umami if you want and, and some a little bit of bitterness. But other than the taste, you also want some different um, experience when you're eating it. So you like some crunch on there. You'd like the bun to be soft. And of course the sausage, uh, the wiener, the frank, whatever you put in it, has to be a really good one, like a quality sausage. So this particular hot dog has been developed over the course of the last three months. First of all, you take a bun then you wrap it in bacon, and it's really important that you wrap every single piece of the bun in bacon so you can't see any of the bun. Then you put it in the oven until the bacon becomes crispy, and then you open it like a regular hot dog. In there I have caramelized onions with cheddar, melted cheddar cheese. Then there's a special piccalilli, which is um, pickled uh, veggies um, and on top of that we have uh, a wiener and then you have ketchup and mayo and then you have crushed paprika bugles. So it's a little bit out there but don't get me wrong, once you, once you taste it you'll be like oh, phenomenal. The name of the hot dog of the day is the I'll Be Damned Dog. And that's of course because it's an homage to the band and it's a special hot dog that is rock and roll. So when you have a band coming to play in your living room and you like making gourmet hot dogs, why the hell wouldn't you throw a big ass rock and roll party in your living room? So, of course I did, and I got people coming in from Copenhagen, all over Denmark, and even Hamburg in Germany. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I feel